unpivot data. What do I mean? I have a data set right here, which has columns and the amounts for three different sales people. So what do I want to accomplish? All I want to do is change this data into this format. And this format requires that the first column is a date, second column is a name. So these names should appear in the second column and these amounts should appear in the third column. That's what we're gonna do in Google Sheets. So the function we're gonna use is called flatten function, flatten. So what does it do? It takes in arguments. What do we want to unpivot? This column needs to be unpivot and concatenate. I'm going to separate it by a comma, then concatenate these columns here. So in other words, I want these dates to go with the names of these columns. That's why I'm saying date first, then the columns, this is the format that I want. Then, and the next one, of course, also separated by a comma, and you see why later on these commas are important. So I concatenate it with the figures right here. Close my brackets, press enter. Right now it provides a value error because it is an array and an array cannot be displayed in a single cell. So to have it displayed in a single cell, we use another uh, Google sheet function called array formula. And the shortcut of getting it is control shift enter. When I press that, then I press, I enter, then you're gonna see that my data is in exactly this, what I want. I want the first one to be a date. Now this number is nothing but a date. I just need to change the formatting and to be fine. Then the next one is the name, which is okay. And the last one is the number or the amount. Now, the next thing I have to do is to separate these figures into separate columns because I want the date in this column F, the name in column G and the amount in column H. So to achieve that, I'm gonna use another Google Sheet function called split. So I type split, the text I want to separate is this result from the flatten function, comma, and the next argument it requires is the delimiter in quotes, my delimiter is a comma, then I close the split function, then close the flatten function and press enter. When you do that, you can see that your data is separated, now it drops into different columns. So to be sure that you have got everything, you can see the number, the count here is 54. If you count out this, it's 54. And right here, you need also to have, if you count this, you also get 54. So this way you have been able to unpivot this data into this format. This is how you unpivot in Google Sheets. Hope this has been helpful. And if so, please hit the subscription button if you have not yet. And see you in the next video. Like the video, give me your comments. Have a great day.